Today we're going to go through a uh, MET technique for an elevated first rib. So this is a really effective technique in clients that have neurovascular compression uh, in thoracic outlet syndrome. So the way we perform this technique, first of all we want to identify if there is an elevated first rib. So we can do that by simple palpation. So let's say this um, right side has got an elevated first rib. The way we perform this is um, bring the shoulder into abduction. We need to move the upper traps out of the way, so we just drag them posteriorly. Place our hand onto the first rib or our thumb, bringing our opposite hand over the top. So we apply our pressure down, so we're sort of going um, down in towards the opposite hip. So the ribs move in this, uh, in this sort of direction as we breathe. Just dragging that upper trap out of the way, applying our pressure. So I'm going to take up that slack, so I'm going to compress down onto that first rib. I'm going to have my client laterally flex to the right, so to the same side. So away you go, so holding that for 7 to 10 seconds. Okay, as they relax, we can take up that slack a little bit more. So usually on the out breath, we take up that slack have them hold their breath, and as they hold their breath, they're going to laterally flex to the right again. Again, holding that for 7 to 10 seconds. And then on the out breath, take up the slack, and we can repeat that about 3 to 5 times until we start to get a, a de decrease in the first rib height. And that's how we perform MET for the first rib.